Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Sister Malika here, AKA Hidden Curls, coming to you with another video. For those of you who knew who are new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. For those of you who've been sticking it out with me through my journey and my through my lock journey for the last three weeks and my loose natural journey, thank you, thank you, thank you. So can you believe it, guys? We have made it to week three of my sister life journey. Week three, guys. Week three. Okay? Unfortunately, week three did come with a challenge. <sighs> so your girl got some slippage. Okay? Got a little couple locks are slipping back there. Which is not bad considering I have over 400 locks in my head. And only two slipping and sliding. I ain't want none to slide. None. But, you know, it happens. Sometimes it happens. So, as you know, Sister Sakina, the sister that did my establishment, lives in North Carolina. So, when she came from North Carolina to do my establishment. And she said she'll be back to do my first retie. And then after that, I start with the new loctician. So the new loctician, I scheduled my appointment, my appointment's for August 5th, and she wanted me to pop in so she could see my hair, okay? She wanted to see what she was getting into, okay? And I said, hmm, I'm not gonna shampoo my hair until after she sees it, okay? So um, when I popped in there today, she examined my hair. She was all in there, all in the scalp and everything, and looking in there and she says mm. she says she really did a good job on your hair i was like yeah yes that's my girl that's my girl yes i knew she did i knew sakina did the daggone thing okay so she said um and then she went back here and she said oh she said you have a couple um like two locks that are slipping they're they're unraveling she said but that's normal she said, but outside of that, overall, your hair looks really good, okay? So I was happy about that. Shout out to Sister Sakina from Foxy Locks. Sister is bomb, and I told you so. And it's a good feeling when another loctician, okay, talks about how good of a job the person that installed your sister locks did. That's just awesome, okay? So again, if you guys live in North Carolina or Philadelphia, She'll come to Philadelphia to, to get you established. Do your um, grid, get you established in the sister, sister lock world. Um, but she can't come back and forth to do the retie, okay? So shout out to my girl, Sister Sakina from Foxy Locks. Girl, you did the dang thing, okay? So she said it probably um, in about nine months, I could probably color my roots if I want to. Um, because of my texture, um, I could probably more than likely be able to start coloring my roots in nine months, okay? She found two locks, I think she said two locks, in the back that are slipping. And let me see if I can show you guys what that looks like. Once, I can Let me see if I can turn around. And this is what slippage looks like. It's right here. One of these locks back here is right here, I think. This one back here is coming out. So slippage is basically that the locks are unraveling. Because this one's intact. So it's this one here. I can actually feel it this one here okay it has unraveled and it's another one back there somewhere that she said has um is unraveling well she said it's, you know i got some slippage back there so she said whatever i do don't wash my hair um because then it will come all the way loose i'm so glad that i went with my first mind because i was going to wash my hair saturday Okay, but I'm so glad I went. My first mind was like, mm, 
I'm going to wait until I see that loctician. But overall, my hair looks good. Yes. So that is the only issue in week three, okay? I mean, you can't win them all. You know, you know when you're on a journey, you know, and this is a sister lock journey, the lock journey, any journey that you're on, you're going to have some type of challenge, okay? And that's a fact, okay? So that's the only thing. Um, but other than that, look, look at your girl. Look at those locks. I am feeling it. So I can't wash my hair. She said, don't wash my hair. Wait until Sakina says she's coming. So the day before um, Sakina comes to do my retie, my initial retie, um, she said then shampoo it. Um, I've already notified Sakina and let her know what's going on. That it is a few locks that's doing electric slide back there. Slide to the left. Slide to the right. <laughs> okay, so, but she's aware. So, um, that way she knows what's going on when she gets here. So, she should be here in, not this coming week, but the following week. She should be here by July the 6th, which is in two weeks. Um, next week will be my fourth week, so that it like be my fifth week, which is still not bad, you know. Four to six weeks is, you know, when you should get that retie. So we'll still be like right there, okay? And then after she does that this time, then I'll be going off to um, Candace of um, a size locks. Um, she, her energy is awesome, okay? Um, the shop is, is awesome. Okay, beautiful spirit, just like uh, Sister Sakina's. And I'm looking forward to um, her doing my locks. I'm looking forward to having her as my loctician. Um, she does a lot there. She also does um, styles. She has these things called um, sprinkles, which I know I can't get in no time soon because it looks like you have to be locked to get them because she actually does a consultation for them. She's certified in um, doing these sprinkles, lock sprinkles, okay? But I am still loving my hair. I'm still loving this journey, although I had a little slippage going on back there. I'm not concerned, not the least bit concerned, because again, I have over 400 locks. So over 400 locks, and I only got like two locks that's slipping. I think that's awesome. Um, Sister Candace did say that it probably came from me pulling my shirt over my head. She said, because you know, at this stage, the locks are very, you know what I mean? Um, they, that's what they do, basically. You know, they can, you know, slide. Uh, that's what happens in the early stages, okay? Until I get locked, so. And it's different things that they, the locks go through during the journey. So I'm probably going to do a video later on down the line about the different challenges that um, you can face um, during the journey. Okay, so that way um, people can be aware before they actually start the journey of the challenges. Now, I knew basically all the challenges um, that I could possibly face and I was fine with it because just like any other journey, there are going to be some challenges. So in conclusion, this week taught me... Um, that you just really have to pay attention, close attention, because I hadn't looked back there. Um, I don't know, for some reason I had the mirror and I was looking everywhere else to see if I had any slippage, but I never thought to go under to the, to the nape of my neck. Um, I never even looked there. So this taught me that I have to really, um, during this journey, I have to really pay attention, okay, to my entire head. Okay, so I'm not going to just look here and look there. I'm going to go throughout my entire hair. Um, I have a three-way mirror, so I'm going to pull that hair up, look all around, and, you know, take a look and make sure I know what's going on. But the good thing is, is that I have two locticians, okay? Two, okay? So what one don't see, the other one will, okay? And um, because... Sakina, she'll just be coming from time to time um, from North Carolina. I'm sure when she pops in, because her and I, you know, we have a pretty good relationship now. Um, like I said, we bonded um, 
doing the install and we've been we're buds you know we're we're pretty good friends i must say so when she comes to philly i know she's going to stop in and she's going to be taking a look at my hair okay and then i have the loctician that's going to be doing my reties starting august the 5th and she'll have her hands in my head um so i mean i, I can't go wrong because i have two locticians so somebody is going to if if someone if one of them slip the other one gonna find it okay period okay can't go wrong with two locticians that are both bomb okay so look guys tell me what you think i'm gonna hear from y'all now um share your own challenges do you have sister locks share your challenges if you have sister locks micro locks um any type of locks that you might have um share with me down below in the comments what your experiences are have been what your challenges challenges are and are you at week three yet are you past week three what were some of the challenges that you faced along the way okay comment down below and tell me what your challenges are until the next time guys peace i'm out